This is my story. It's the usual thing. Boy meets girl. Boy loses girl. Boy meets another girl. Well, but I'm getting ahead of myself. I don't think my life is all flowers and romance, though. I wish. More and more, my life is spent out here, fighting some of the worst the city has to offer. Sometimes it's just a mugger. Sometimes it's a bigger problem. This is the city I protect, New York City. It's my home, my playground, my responsibility. Ah, and this is Mary Jane, the girl next door, the girl I love. But love is a tricky thing when you live part of your life behind a mask. Fate handed me amazing powers, and I made a promise to use those powers to help people. With great power comes great responsibility. No matter how much I might wish things were different, there's only one Spider-Man. Well, sequel time already, huh? Welcome back, I guess. I'm sure you miss me more than I miss you. Anyway, things have changed around here since last time, so they dragged me back at great expense to explain what's up. First things first. You're not much of a wall crawler if you can't, you know, stick to walls, so here's what you do. You walk or run into a wall and hold the grab button. Voila, you stick to the wall. It works when you're swinging or jumping, too. <laughs> Moving right along, let's talk jumping. Hold down the jump button and you'll charge your jump. This yellow bar shows how strong your jump will be when you let go of the button. You got it? You sure? You don't actually jump until you've let go of the jump button. Okay, now go jump in a lake. If you tap the jump button, you'll just do a little hop. A little, a little hop. That's because you didn't charge your jump. Am I going too fast for you? Let's get this show on the road. See that little doohickey? That's your destination marker, and it tells you how to get where you need to go. Clever, huh? When it's in the middle of the screen, you know you're heading towards your goal. Easy, right? All right, stop there for a second and look at your map. See it there? That red thing in the center is you, and the blue dot is your destination marker. The line that connects each dot to the map represents how high off the ground that particular thing is. Oh, that makes sense, right? <laughs> yeah, sure it does. Everything's broken into chapters, and every chapter opens with one of these nifty little slow-mo things. Those words zipping by under the chapter title are the items on your to-do list, so get busy. Okay, so the next thing I want you to do is jump off the building. I mean it, just jump. Hey, I wouldn't tell you to do something dangerous and life-threatening, would I? Come on. Huh. You always do it. Huh. I guess you're smarter than you look. Good for you. So, let me tell you a little about swinging. Every time you press the swing button, you'll see a new web line. There's all kinds of fancy stuff you can do, but let's take baby steps, shall we? Now that you're out and about, why don't you swing around for a while? You know, do your thing. I'll check up on you later. You're fine. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay, I'm back. For the next lesson, let's talk about... Hey, what's going on down there? Stop, please! Well, that's convenient. The arcade just got held up and the robbers are driving away. What are you gonna do about it? Looks like playtime is over. Looks like the robbers are escaping on foot. Don't teach them about justice. You know, by beating the snot out of them. Hey, this isn't a living Want to see something cool? Sprint after that last robber by holding the sprint button while you run, then hold attack when you get up to the thug. That move is called a sprint uppercut. Oh, trouble! <laughs> nice going. Now get back to the arcade. You know, you should check out some of the games he's got, too. Thanks, Spider-Man. Listen, if you ever want to play some games, come on by. It's on the house. Bring up your zoom map for a second, would you? 
This map is real useful. You can see destination markers and all kinds of other useful locations on here. Check it out when you get lost. But you'll never get lost, I know you. A destination marker for this first Spidey store just appears. Go buy the speed upgrade, then we'll move on. And if you love, then I'm done. City's been quiet lately. Maybe my luck's finally changing. <laughs> Isn't it beautiful, Rosie? This will be my gift to the world. Unlimited energy. The power of a sun harnessed for the good of all mankind. Don't forget the good of Otto. Eat something. The world will still be here in half an hour. Uh, before we go any further, I think it might be a good idea to save your progress, if you can call it that. Just go to the pause menu and bring up the save load screen. Easy, right? Well, then do it. Oh, no. Dr. Connor's class. I got so caught up in what I was doing, I forgot all about it. It's gonna kill me. I'm running so late. Still, I should be able to make it as long as... Help me! Ah, right on cue. I was almost there, too. Sorry, Dr. Connors. Don't let them get the case. Give us the case or you won't get hurt! <laughs> I got her. Let's clear out of here. Spider, we're gonna need more men. Looks like interference showed up. Didn't your mom tell you not to hit girls? I really don't have time for them. Flash, flash, fire! Spider-Man's here already! Get rid of him and get that case! always happen when I'm running late. Take secure! Oh. Hi, my name's Spider-Man and I'll be your rescuer today. Thank you so much for saving me! The briefcase, you got it back! Thank goodness! Why did they want this so badly? I'm sorry, I can't really talk about it. Alright, well at least try to be more careful from now on. Don't worry. Maybe I can still make it before class ends. Dr. Connors. Peter. I'm sorry. For missing class, I was on my way, but... Peter, I don't want to hear excuses. You have a keen scientific mind. 
but your grades are slipping. You miss class half the time, and when you do show up, you're asleep in your seat. Yes, Dr. Connors. I understand. Have you started your paper on Dr. Octavius yet? He's a good friend of mine, so you'd better know what you're talking about. Uh, well, I've been thinking about it. <sighs> Thinking isn't your problem. But that paper isn't going to write itself, Peter. And if you don't get your act together, you're in serious danger of failing this class. I know, Dr. Connors. I'll pull things together. I promise. I hope so. I'll see you in class. I think this might be a good time for you to check your to-do list. It'll show you what you still need to do in the current chapter. The white dot on your map here and the white destination marker are both pointing you to the pizza parlor. You'll need to get over there at some point, but there's no rush. This is a good time to talk a little about hero points. You already know that you use them to buy stuff from the Spidey store, right? Oh, well, you don't? Well, then you weren't paying attention. Naturally, you're gonna want to earn lots of them. You got plenty of options to do it. Stopping crimes, helping citizens in distress, doing challenges, collecting items, and delivering pizza. There's some other ways too, so try different things and see what you like. But you can only be a good guy. I got a bunch of pizzas to deliver, and you're late. Always, you are late. Well, now you have to hurry. Get going. You got it, Mr. Aziz. I'll deliver those pizzas before you know it. I'll start there. Now, that's the pizza Mr. Aziz will flip out. Careful, Spidey. Remember, get to the mic being played. I get some pizza. Gotta get back and return it back. You did good, Parker. Everyone got their pizzas. Good job. Keep it up, and there will always be work for you. Wow, Mr. Aziz. Thanks. on this guy. He keeps blocking you. You better try a different tactic or I'm gonna fall asleep. Maybe sting a little. Thanks for saving me. You got it. Ah, uh, still late. I promised Gary and MJ that I would meet them this evening.
later. You made it. Happy birthday. Hey, buddy. MJ and I had a bet going on whether you would actually show up. Thanks, Harry. Hey, MJ. I'm almost afraid to ask, but who won the bet? I did, of course. Okay, Harry, pay up. <laughs> all right, all right. Are you sleeping all right, Pete? You look beat. Just some late nights. Still palling around with that murdering bug? Harry, I know you think Spider-Man killed your dad. He did kill my dad. Someday I'll get him for it, too. You tell him that next time you see it. Yeah, uh, well... Hey, congratulations on those billboards, MJ. Oh, thanks. Um, it's so unexpected. Everything's happening at once. The billboards, the play, which you have to come see, by the way. I'll get you a ticket for your birthday. Can you swing by later and pick it up? Huh? Oh, <laughs> swing by, yeah. Thanks. Yeah, I, I promise I'll go. So, uh, what's up at Oscorp lately? Uh, I'm heading up special projects now. We've been providing funding and tritium for one of your heroes, Dr. Octavius. You want to meet him? Do I? That would be great, Harry. I'll set everything up then. Hey, come on, let's eat. Man, that cake looks good. I'm stuffed. I'd better burn off some calories or I won't fit in my costume anymore. <coughs> I can't even remember the last time I sat here with Mary Jane. MJ's been busy with acting. Larry's got Oscorp. Well, who am I kidding? I haven't seen them because I can't this time. them off. Surprise! Happy to see Look me! Out. Here comes the Oh yeah. Hi, my name is Spider-Man and I'll be your standing sensei. With the green question. There was a chase that just fed past here. Someone almost got hit. That chase picked up. Someone could get hurt. I'd better help stop those girls. Nathan, he's wrecking the car! <laughs> Thank 
Showed up, webhead. Oh no! At my birthday dinner, I promised MJ I would meet her this evening. I gotta hurry. Sorry, I'm running a little late, MJ. I've gotten used to it. It was great seeing you and Harry again the other night. Yeah. Anyway, I brought you the ticket for my play. Peter, I think you should know. I'm seeing someone now. A guy. Oh. Really? Huh. Really? Is that all you have to say? Oh my gosh. Uh... I... I have to go. Of course you do. I'm really sorry, MJ. I really want to talk more. I'll call you. Yeah. Sure. I can't believe I ran off like that. I must be out of my mind. This may not be art, but I like it. <laughs> Who? <laughs> you got nice moves. For a dork in tights. Are these yours? <laughs> Please. Wait! Imagine. Hey, slow down so I can talk to you. Oh, 
skin tight leather. Doesn't that kind of chafe? You'll never find out, that's for sure. You always chase girls who brush you off? No, only the naughty ones. I have standards, after all. Standard is the word. And here I was expecting... amazing. Hey! Yep, got away with the ladies, Spidey. Mr. Smooth. Who was with that girl? Who was she? You know, this chapter opening reminds me of something. The Spidey store gets new items every time a new chapter starts. Aha! Next time you have a chance, visit the store and check out what they've got. That girl was pretty incredible. Too bad she's probably a crook. Why am I late?
Hi, Pete. Pictures for the boss? Actually, I'm hoping he might have an assignment for me. Well, he's in a pretty good mood today. Maybe you'll get lucky. Go ahead in. Finally, someone who hasn't been bamboozled by that media-grabbing glory seeker, Spider-Man. This Quentin Beck's a special effects guy from Hollywood. Says he's got Spider-Man all figured out. Sounds like a media-grabbing glory seeker to me. Oh, Parker. I don't pay you for your opinion, Parker. I pay you for photos. Well, I... Let me guess. You don't have any pictures, do you? Uh... You're fired. Come back when you get me shots of that red and blue wacko. I think that's the third time JJ's fired me this week. Peter. Everything going okay? Hey, Robbie. Jonah beating you up again? <laughs> don't mind him. Listen, I have a job you could do for me. We need a picture for a story. I want a high shot of the whole city. Here, if you have a map handy, I'll mark where I'd like you to take the picture. Can you get it for me? Sure thing, Robbie. I'll be back before you know it. Thanks. This is great, Peter. I knew I could count on you. Take these photos to Jonah, and if you're ever having any trouble getting work from him, you come talk to me. You never know what I might have for you. Thanks, Robbie. I will. Hi, Pete. How are you doing today? Hi, Betty. I'm okay. Is Mr. Jameson around? Sure. Go on in. What do you want, Parker? Robbie said... Give me those. What is this garbage? Why are you bringing me shots of the city and not shots of Spider-Man? This is the sorriest excuse for... Oh, wait a second. Robbie wanted these, didn't he? Yeah, they're fine. Now get out of my office. Check it out. 
Let's get out of here. Rhino, get that equipment back to base, understood? Spider-Man, huh? Finally, I've been dying to see what you can do. Let's go. Ah, just try to break through my armor. <laughs> I'm gonna break your bones and make you cry for your mama. Rhino, I'm gonna take a wild guess that you're strong but dumb. Whoa, that rhino is one tough cookie. You don't want to get hit by him. Luckily, you've got spider seeds. See that flash on your head? No, on the screen, not on your real head. That's a warning that you're about to be attacked. When you see it, press the grab button to dodge out of the way. In addition to the obvious advantage of not getting pummeled, a dodge can also set up attacks and turn the tide in a fight. Yeah! No more messing around! Horn on your head, or you just uh, kind of see me? Yeah. Oh, I'm not around. Why Watch out! 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 Gonna kill me. Sorry to leave you hanging, Rhino, but I don't want to be accused of poaching. I think the police should be able to handle you at this point. Have fun. Jeez, you're pretty tough for such a scrawny little guy. Why am I late? Anything I can do for you? Spidey! Someone's car is being stolen! Help! Please! Don't worry, I'm on it. Let's get in the drive.
was such a nice of it. Thank you, Spider-Man! Oh, sure boy. thing, I'm late. About time you got here. I was a busy man, and I don't want to keep him waiting. Sorry, Harry. Never mind, let's go. Whoa. Harry, it's good to see you again. Otto, your guests are here. Harry? Otto, Rose, let me introduce my good friend, Peter Parker. It's a huge honor to meet Parker. you. Parker. Hmm. My friend Dr. Connors told me about a brilliant student of his named Parker who can't seem to stay awake in class. <laughs> I'm sure Kurt has beaten him up enough already, Otto. You're right, of course. This is my wife, Rosie, without whom I would be lost. She is my assistant and inspiration. Come and take a look at my masterpiece. There it is. Sustained fusion has never been possible before. Why? Once the reaction reaches a certain point, it becomes impossible to contain and control it. Exactly. Until now. Using tritium in the core, provided exclusively by Oscorp. Yes, of course. As I was saying, tritium in the core lends the reaction more stability. And these arms are the key. Amazing. How do they work? Well, you see, Peter, we don't want to keep Otto from his work. Uh, in that case, Peter, won't you join us for dinner next time you visit? I'm sure Otto would be happy to explain more then. I would love to. Thanks. See you then. 
I can't believe I actually got to meet Dr. Otto Octavius. Spider-Man, help! What's up? Spider-Man, some folks are shooting at the police! Surrender immediately! No one's getting shot on my watch. Need something? No, no, hey, Spidey! Is your refrigerator running? Cause I sure am! Alright! Oh, my trap work! Oh no, you don't know me in the prior batch. Next time you're in with someone, check him as a superhero oh. first. Oh. I think you saved me, you should've said. Take a night, Gracie. Oh. This was a bad idea. Thanks for saving me. No problem.
guy looks like you're having a little trouble. See, the thing about challenges is sometimes you need to do things in a particular way. Check down in the corner. If there's any special instructions, that's where you'll find them. Don't forget that. Y'all should have stayed away, you know what I'm saying? Can't we all just get along? Yikes! Now we turn it up a notch. Bam! You're going to hurt someone. You rang? An armored car down the street is being robbed! You won't get away with this. Wanna bet? Guess break time is over. Oh, trouble! Heads up! You better not get pizza delivered this way. Kid, how you making out? Listen, I got a new job for you to do, okay? There's these things called photo op tokens that I want you to find. I've marked them on your map just to spell it out real plain for you. Now get to work. Lucky for you, I just... oh, oh, man. Man. I can't believe you helped me.
Uh oh. Guess I'd better check out that alarm. I'd know that silhouette anywhere. I'd better catch her. I wouldn't keep chasing you if you didn't keep breaking into places. Just making things harder on yourself. I think you mean I'm making things harder on you. I figured you needed a challenge in your life. <gasps> Not bad. I actually had to push myself this time. Hand over those jewels you took. <laughs> jewels? I saw you leaving that jewelry store. You know, the one with the alarm blasting. <laughs> I don't have any jewels. Wait, what's your name? Me? I'm Black Cat, and I just crossed your path. Now, if you'll excuse me. Whoa. Black Cat, huh? Black cat seems okay. Maybe a little bit of an attitude, though. I wonder if there's a Mr. Black cat. Oh, what am I thinking? Peter, I guess you're running late, or else you thought we were meeting at the movies. Anyway, the movie's starting soon, and I don't want to be late, so I headed over there. Meet me there, if you aren't already there. Ugh, I knew I was running later than I thought. I need to hurry. The movie's starting soon. Hey, MJ.
Ah, uh, looks like you weren't gonna finish this challenge under the allotted time. Go ahead and finish it if you want. It might help you figure out where you need to go next time you try. If you just want to stop, though, you can pause the game and quit the challenge. It's up to you. No one's around. I better change while I have a chance. I can't just stop and chat. Ooh, sorry, Pete. No assignments at the moment. Come back later, okay? Gonna prove I'm a fake, huh? This I got it. on Spider-Man. All right, we'll have to see how it plays out. Here comes Quentin Beck now. And now, your MC and host for this evening. You know his legendary work from such films as Cyborg Babysitter and Tears of an Alien Bounty Hunter, a man who has worked tirelessly for the entertainment of all mankind. Ladies and gentlemen, it gives me great pleasure to introduce that master of film magic and illusion, that expert of the unknown, the one, the only, Quentin Beck! Thank you for coming, Spider-Man. I know you couldn't resist. I don't like people building a career off bad enough in the back. What about that newspaper man, Jameson? JJ? He just has a knack for hiring good photographers. Well, Spider-Man, now that you're here, let's get right to it. Your first challenge will be something you're supposedly quite good at. Rounding up criminals. That's it. All right, whatever. 
Oh, there's more to it than that. After you collect each criminal, deposit him in one of the three holding pits here. And by the way, you'll only get a point if you use the pit with the green light. I'll be competing against you, and there will be three waves of criminals. If I, with no so-called superpowers, collect more criminals than you in the allotted time, then the world will be able to see clearly what a sham you are. I don't know what happened to make you so delusional, Vic, but bring it on! Well, it looks like they're getting ready to start. According to the press release, the city's Department of Corrections provided the criminals Beck and Spidey will be collecting. Right, Steve. And virtually every one of these convicted criminals is someone Spider-Man helped capture, including one celebrity criminal, Herman Schultz, a.k.a. The Shocker. Well, it should be interesting to see how that affects the results. Oh, it looks like they're starting. Ready, Spider-Man? Let's begin. This is one hero who knows what it takes to control a situation. You're right, Steve. But Beck still has plenty of time. As a wise man once said, it ain't over till it's over. Last batch of inmates, and Spidey has been showing everyone how it's done. Beck is going to have to do some fancy flying if he's going to make a comeback now. have more tricks up your sleeve than I expected. Still, this last challenge will prove who is the better man once and for all. Is that what this is really about, Beck? Proving that you're better than I am? I don't have to answer that. You're the one being tested here, not me. Whoa. Sounds like I hit a nerve. This is our last challenge, ladies and gentlemen. You've seen how cleverly Spider-Man can maintain his illusion of heroism. But now, all his supposed skills and abilities will be put to the ultimate test in a one-on-one -on -one challenge against me. Here are the rules, Spider-Man. I have built an obstacle course. You will start here. All you have to do is reach the end of the course, hitting these switches along the way. I, meanwhile, will be manning an electric cannon. If I see you, you can be sure I'm gonna hit you with the cannon. Don't worry, the cannon is not lethal But once I hit you three times, the contest is over and I win. That cannon doesn't sound too great, but if I back out now, I'll never live it down. Let's get this over with. Well, I don't know about you, Bob, but from where I sit, things don't seem to be going so well for Quentin Beck. I agree, Steve. He's going to have to do some pretty fancy shooting here if he wants anyone to take his claim seriously. All right, now that you're in position, let's begin. Come out, come out, wherever you are! Ah, there you are. Why don't 
don't you just give up, Spider-Man? Gotcha! Not as fast as you find the people that think, are you? You're going to need to move a lot faster than that, Spider-Man! Come on! You don't want to disappoint your fans, do you? Here. Why don't you just give up, Spider-Man? And disappoint all my loyal fans. I couldn't possibly do that. You're a sad little man, Beck. I know you, but what am I? Nothing like this. 
They're starters. Gotcha! Not as fast as you'd like people to think, are you? You're going to need to move a lot faster than that, Spider-Man. Come on! You don't want to kiss a bunch of fans? Hey! And as for you, Beck, stick with the movies. It's obvious reality is way too much for you to handle. Uh, how could he? It isn't fair. He doesn't deserve the spotlight. It just isn't fair. Oh, he can't win. He won't win. That smug bug. Let's see how he likes it when I turn this cannon to maximum power. <laughs> oh, oh. What? The laser is overheating? Oh, stupid machine! Work! Work! Come on, work! Problems with your laser bag? I hear there are pills for that now. This was too easy, Beck. I guess I should thank you, though. I really needed some good press for a change. See ya. No, oh, it's not fair. It's not fair. He should have won. All the work. The obstacle course, yes, the obstacle course was good. Oh, the electric cannon, the electric cannon. Why, why? Hey, Beck, what was it like competing with Spider-Man? Is there anything that guy can't do? Beck, Beck, what does this do to your theories about the web-slinger? Uh, are you ready to admit you were wrong? Even the audience isn't real. Beck is the real phony here. Hopefully that's the last I'll hear from Beck. Spidey, you the man! Huh. Oh, Spider-Man! Jeez Louise, it's always something in this town. Problem? Spider-Man, don't let that person fall! I, I can't hold on! Much longer! Okay. Hang on! I'm slipping! Gotcha! Don't worry. You rescued me! Thank you so much. Waste the hero first. What he's done, all bets are off. You're going to hurt someone. Whoa, whoa! Hey! Make it night, Greasy.
I'm lost again. Spider-Man, a carjacker just made off with someone's car. It was just a second ago. Help me! Someone help me! Don't worry, I'm on it. We're doing the drive. He's going to catch us! Shooting over there. Come out with your hands up. You ain't taking us. No one's getting shot on my watch. Let's bring it to show up.
I need to talk up! Menace! Hi, my name is Spider-Man and I'll be your superhero today. Spidey, you have to help me! They, they... Oh no, they're here! No! Ah, we tricked you! Stupidity. Peter, welcome. Otto and I have been looking forward to seeing you again. You two chat, I'll go check on dinner. Thank you for having me. I don't know how I would manage without Rosie. When you find the woman for you, Peter, don't let her go. <laughs> I digress. Here, let me show you something. Actually, Dr. Octavius, may I ask you something? Mm -hmm. The fusion reactor is brilliant, but how will you control the reaction? Ah, that is the secret, isn't it? I... I'm afraid the lecture will have to be delayed. Dinner is ready. Ah, well, I'll explain it over dinner, Peter. Shall we? Dr. Octavius' theories are amazing. My head is still spinning from talking to him. Oh, no. 
Mary Jane's play. If I hurry, I can still make it in time. From here, let's do this. What? Not now. Whoa! Looks like an affair showed up. Aren't done in forever? Oh, okay. Fight tonight, guys. This is the part where you fall down. Oh. Oh. How about a little consideration for other people's time? You okay? Maybe I can still make it before the end. Jameson, what are you doing here? Well, there's this beautiful girl in the cast. Did she say Jameson? Someone shoot me now. Stalking girls now? <laughs> well, that's pretty pathetic, don't you think? Or is she on your naughty list, too? N not exactly. What do you care, anyway? No reason. I'm just dropping by to say hi. By the way, remember those guys you beat up the other day in the art gallery? I remember. Well, it turns out there's a whole ring of them. I just happened to find their hideout the other day. I could show you. If you can take a break from the peeping Tom routine, that is. Uh, sure. I really wasn't spying, you know. You're getting a lot better at following me. I think there may be hope for you yet. Hey, I was just going easy on you before. Funny. Hang on a second, let me catch up. What made you come get me? Isn't that what you do? Well, yeah, but... Hey, I can be nice. I don't always bite. Unless you want me to. Come on now. 
Don't fall behind. So. You're finally here. I was just about to settle in for a little nap. All right, let's go. Come on, Spidey. Look at all lethargic on me. Keep up. Lethargic? You're the one weaving like a drunken sailor. There they are, as advertised. Get the rest of this stuff in the truck. We gotta get out of here before Spider-Man shows up. Hmm. Nice sculpture. Now the kind of quick. Did they give a volume discount? She make a pretty good team. Cat? Ugh. She took that statue. I must have sucker tattooed on my forehead. I took that statue right in front of me. Hey, Spidey! Why wasn't I watching her? I knew Cat was a thief. I can't believe Cat did that. You're looking a little down. Girl trouble. Huh? Uh, uh, something like that. Parker! I'm right here, Mr. Jameson. Don't just stand there with your mouth hanging open. Beck is having a news conference, and I need a photographer down there. Another one? But didn't Spider-Man pass his tests? They were rigged! Get down there now! What do you think Beck's got this time? 
Who knows? He's a little loopy, right? Hollywood types. <laughs> Mysterio, I am Mysterio. I am determined that your planet is right for conquest. <laughs> Mysterio? No, I've seen everything. <laughs> Don't have more than you Your fate is sealed. What for your life? How did the fishbowl get stuck on your head? You said, you know, you are no match for the power of Mysterio. Mysterio? I think I had a bowl of Mysterios for breakfast. Ah, ah, I'm not going to make it! I'm slipping! Those reporters. If I can get them up to that fountain, we should be able to escape. You gotta hurry, they're almost blind. I'm going to keep I'm friends. slipping!
UFO invasion. Right. Your 
UFOs? Hidden Fortress? Give me a break. This guy's watching way too much late night TV. Now, how do I get back from here? Hey buddy, can you give me a lift? I left my wallet in my other costume. Mysterio's hidden fortress looks just like an apartment. A hidden door concealed by a bookcase? Mysterio, you brilliant fiend! 
Well, I guess I'd better check it out. Glad no one was around to see that. Where the heck am I? Welcome, Spider-Man! So glad you could drop in! Hey, it's Mysterio. The cliché who walks like a man. Silence! It appears to meet your end in my... Funhouse of Doom! Funhouse of Doom? I thought you were an alien. Silence! <clears throat> as I was saying, even as we speak, I am watching you for life and control. Perhaps you can find me. Did you survive? <laughs> Let's begin, shall we? Let me introduce you to my friend, Mr. Hoppenack. Such a cheerful fellow, isn't he? We'll soon discover that he's quite the cut-up. Ugh, I thought my jokes were bad. Okay, Mr. Hoppenack, let's see what you've got. So much for you. It may sting a little. Well, well done, you sound like man. Please, I'm very careful. Look at this place. Let me guess, you're trying to make the cover of Super Villain Decorator Monthly. Right, Mysterio? Okay. I've been flipped off before, but never quite like that. What's going on? It feels so strange. He's upside down. What's going on? Yeah. Not to me terror. Fun house up to Crazed. Great. One of those hopping actions. Better be careful. Is your crummy attitude, sourpuss? Oh, back to normal at last. Huh. Looks like that chute is my only way down. Ready or not, Mysterio, here I come. I think I've lost some weight. Okay. Fun time is over. I need to figure out how to get out of here so I can find Mysterio and knock some sense into that domed head of his. What was that? Now, prepare to be the most dangerous adversary. Your servant. Ah! Nuts, nuts, nuts. Nuts, nuts. Hey, Mysterio, does your mothership know where you are? No, she not. not. Finding these guys is a bad taste in my mouth. Did David Copperfield bite you as a kid, Mysterio? Now you will be your king. Here, no, they're pointing you at the sci-fi you? Nice tricks, Mysterio. Can you pull a rabbit out of a hat? Stop hitting yourself. Stop hitting yourself. No, seriously. Soon I will appreciate this whole city to my bill. It's only a matter of time before this crackpot actually hurts someone. <laughs> there has to be a lawsuit here somewhere. <laughs> Coming at ya! Succumb to your fist! Try not to run into my fist with your face.
Lucky for you, I flew my budget. Think about a career change. Looks like I found the exit. Finally. A hologram? Why should I be surprised? You may have fought my fights this time, Spider-Man, but I'll be back. I promise you that. <laughs> uh-huh. Heard it before. About a million times. Finally out of that crazy place. If I never see another carnival as long as I live, it'll be too soon. I wonder where Mysterio got to. I have the feeling I'm going to run into Mysterio again before long. Hey! Hey, Spidey! Where, Where did he you? come from? Hey, he came out of nowhere. Give it to me straight. Do I look fat in these tights? Spider-Man! Some kind of robots are attacking people! <laughs> I don't want to die! Don't panic. I'll deal with it. charge for delivery. Oh, thank you, Spider-Man. Give it to me straight. Do I look fat in these tights? Thugs are holding up that armored car! If I could just reach my utility belt, don't give me an excuse. Don't worry, I'll stop them. Oh! I should've known. Oh. I couldn't even 
wait for it to get to the bank, huh? You're in for it now. <laughs> you bleed, you die. Sting a little, please stop. Executing escape plan, Epsilon. Insurance is paid up. This was a bad idea. Thank you, Spider Man. No problem. Whoops, Dr. Octavius' demonstration will be starting soon. I better hurry. Thank you for coming, ladies and gentlemen. You are all about to witness the dawning of a new age. The power of a sun is now ours.
those plasma blasts are really dangerous. I have to be careful. That's two. Fluctuations are getting worse. I have to hurry. Almost got it. Only one terminal left. Is releasing plasma more and more quickly. I have to hurry. I have to hurry. The containment field looks like it's buckling. I don't have time for subtlety. I just have to smash these power terminals until the reactor shuts down. Fluctuations are getting worse. I have to hurry. Almost got it. Only one terminal left. Those plasma blasts are really dangerous. I have to be careful. I have to hurry. The containment field looks like it's buckling. I don't have time for subtlety. I just have to smash these power terminals until the reactor shuts down. Those plasma blasts are really dangerous. I have to be careful. That's two. Fluctuations are getting worse. I have to hurry. Almost got it. Only one terminal left. I did it. What, what a mess. Dr. Octavius. It sounds like an ambulance is coming. I'd better get out of here. Somehow I just know I'm gonna get blamed for this. Well, the city didn't get blown up. Poor Rosie. It's funny! I, I need to no. talk to you! Hey, I think the police are chasing someone. My car just came through here way too fast. I'm sure the police can catch these guys. Someone could get hurt in the meantime. Let me see if I can... We all just get along. Come on, Spider. Web Swinger just showed up. Let's deal with the Web Slinger first. Going to 
hurt someone. Oh, I can't believe I'm late to see Dr. Connors again. Right, Otto, just calm down. Let's call the police. Police? No! No police! Otto, we need to get you help. You're obviously not well. Get away from me, you traitor. Huh? Yeah. He wants to turn me into the police. Is this how you pay my friendship? No! <laughs> yes, of course. That murderous arachnid Spider-Man. He killed Rosie. Destroyed my life's work in an instant. I'll rebuild it, though, and kill him. It shouldn't have been like this. You're right. If I'm a criminal, then I will have to act as a criminal to do what I must. I need money. I need to rebuild. For Rosie. Dr. Connors, I'm sorry, I'm... Dr. Connors! Otto... No! Uh, Otto, what the heck did he mean by that? Dr. Connors is pretty beat up, but I think he'll be alright now. I need to figure out what happened to him, but I don't have any leads. I should drop by the Daily Bugle, maybe I can pick up a lead there. Or at least earn enough to pay my electric bill. All the world is my dressing room. Hi, Betty. Any chance I can get in to talk to Mr. Jameson? Hey, Pete. He's in a meeting with Robbie, but it's nothing important. Go ahead, Ann. Octavius! Four extra arms! Dr. Octopus! It's like he was asking for it! Page one, Robbie! Dr. Octopus rampages! Got it, Jonah. What are you talking about? Oh, Parker. That Fruit Loop physicist went nuts, killed the doctors who were working on him, and ran out of the hospital. Killed them? That can't be. It's true, Pete. All right, get out of my office. This is a newspaper, not a knitting circle. Dr. Octavius is a killer. Is it my fault? Can things get any worse? No, nope. wait, whoa, I withdraw the question.
Problems? Spider-Man, some thugs are shooting at the police. Come out with your hands up. Come and get us! Uh -oh. Better stop. change something wrong What you need? Oh, Spider-Man, thank goodness you're here. This guy, he's gotta go to the hospital. Fast! Oh, the pain. Make it stop. Oh, make it stop. Oh. Don't worry, he's as good as there. Ah. Yeah. Oh. Try not to kill, okay? Be all right now. On to what do we say?
Hi, my name is Spider-Man, and I'll be your superhero today. Hey, some guy just got his car stolen at gunpoint. They went that way. No, please! Not while I have anything to say about it. At me. Sorry I'm late. Peter, don't be sorry. I was just worried about you. Thank you for taking the time to help me. It's no problem, Aunt May. Let's go in. Now about your loan, Mrs. Parker. Ah! Oh, no! I've got to get away! Ah! Ladies and gentlemen, I am making a withdrawal. Kindly remain calm and silent so that we can avoid unnecessary damage. Peter, where are you going? Your boy is quite the hero. Stop right there, Doctor. This is Spider-Man. What a Still, not one for which I am wholly unprepared. All right, you go. Get him. Ever work for a right here, Doctor? You got it, Doctor. I think you saved what you should have said. Better up! This was a bad idea. I don't want to fight you. You brought me to this wreck. I was trying to help. I wish you could see that. Stay back, insect. I will destroy you. I demand satisfaction. Oh, I hate to do this, but... I don't have time to bother with you. If you interfere with me at that old woman's peril.
Amazing. I read about Octavius. It's packed, but somehow I just didn't believe it. Hey, it's <gasps> Octavius blames me for Rosie's death. Guess I can't say I'm surprised. So, Spanny, you have to help me. Thanks. Oh no, they're here. Ah! You messed up our plans for the last time. Oh, no, please don't throw me in the fire, Pat. Such a nuisance. Move. This is the part where you fall down. Get a job. I only want five. One. Sure. Problems? An armored car down the street is being robbed. Let us go. Stow it. Leave it to me.
Uh oh, it's already starting. I better get down there fast if I want to avoid getting fired again. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm very pleased to introduce you all to Miss Mary Jane Watson. Mary Jane has just agreed to marry me, and I couldn't wait to share my happiness with everyone. So what's the hump superpower? Throw a football in the moon. Uh-huh. Red is easily impressed, isn't she? Shouldn't you try to find somebody more your speed? Just what I needed. Love advice from a thief. Are you still sore about that statue? I gave it to the cops already. I was just having some fun with you. You look kind of cute, trying to figure out what happened back at that warehouse. Anyway, my original point was, why are you still bothering with a normal girl? Normal is boring. Normal is half my life. At least it's supposed to be. Why? I mean, seriously. Why some for being some schmo when you could be a superstar? Well? Forget it. Well, I was going to tell you about Shocker, but you're obviously busy sulking. Shocker? What about him? Oh, just that he broke out of prison a little while back, and he's back in the city. I was going to show you where he's hiding out, but... Show me. <laughs> That's a spirit? Trust me, kicking his heavily padded butt will make you feel better. Yeah, you're probably right. Let's go. Come on now. Don't fall <gasps> behind. So, how did you find Shaka? Well, apparently he escaped during your little event with Quentin Beck. Seriously? <laughs> I knew I should have kept a better eye on that guy. Still, I was a little distracted at the time. one weaving like a drunken sailor.
Okay. Oh, yeah. He just caught me off guard. I'll be ready for him next time. Uh, listen, I gotta get going. I have some things I need to do. See ya. Check on cat later. Webhead, looking good. Oh my gosh. Problem? It's an alien invasion. I always knew they would come sooner or later. We're doomed. I don't want to die. Okay, find cover. I've got some bad guys to deal with. Watch out! <laughs> What Shocker is planning. Yo, help! I, I just heard gunshots. Come out with your hands up. Shooting? I'll deal with it. Is that all you got? Try not to run into my fist in your face. Find a safe line of work. You'll have to catch the Spider-Man. Our car's in no shape to go after him. I'll get him.
Need help? I think the police are chasing someone. A car just came through here, going way too fast. If that chase keeps up, someone could get hurt. I'd better help stop those trucks. Make oh, he's gonna crash us! Splat. Spidey, wait up! What's up? Talk to me. Spidey, I just... Ah, uh, I saw him. I can't do it. I'm sorry, Spidey! Oh, no. Please don't throw me in a riot patch. to run into my fist with your face.
Yeah, great timing. Jonah was just yelling for you. Go on in. <laughs> Thanks, Betty. You were looking for me, Mr. Jameson? Parker, where were you 15 minutes ago? There's a Latverian diplomat coming into the city by helicopter. He's landing any moment, and I need a photo. Now get over there like your job depended on it. Got it, Mr. Jameson. holding up a convenience store. This I have to see. Get a job! Make your sudden movements quickly. I require large amounts of your currency. Sure, space dude, whatever you say. Just don't disintegrate me or whatever. How low the mighty have fallen. You dare to challenge the infinite light of Mysterio? I will destroy you utterly. You will bear witness to the majesty and glory of my power. Die. You have trifled with my power for the last time! <laughs> Whoa! That was sick, dude! You rocked so hard, Spidey! No! Oh, uh, I I give up! Don't don't hit me again! Quentin Beck, I presume. Say cheese! Great! Now to get these photos to the bugle. should be a safe spot to change. I have to see Jonah. I have pictures of Spider-Man for him. Okay, Pete. Go on in. Parker, what do you want? I have some photos you might want to see. Remember Quentin Beck? Turns out, he was Mysterio. So, Beck and Spider-Man weren't cahoots all along. How can you look at those pictures and say that? I don't have time for your moral outrage, Parker. I'm trying to run a paper here and make sure my son's wedding to Jean Marie doesn't bankrupt me. Her name is Mary Jane. Yeah, right, right. I'll give you 200 for the lot. You can collect your money on your way out. I can't believe that. Jameson would frame his own mother if he thought it would sell papers. What did I ever do to Jameson? What could he possibly have against me? Need a hand? Don't hurt me! Wait, I'm trying to help. Uh, I'm so sick of everyone hating me. I'm going to go give the Bugle's esteemed publisher a piece of my mind. He's messed up my reputation long enough. I need to have a word with the publisher of the Daily Bugle. Oh, there, mighty one. Take a deep breath. That paper has turned half the city against me. I'm sick and tired of it. <laughs> well, I'm sure that bursting into the Bugle offices and yelling will clear everything up. All I'm saying is, you may want to calm down. <sighs> you seriously need to loosen up. Have more fun. You're a superhero. You, you swing through New York City in brightly colored tights. I like my costume. The point is... Here you are, powers far beyond those of mortal men. And you're pouting on a rooftop. What's up with that? <laughs> I guess you're right. What did you have in mind? Well, I did find Shocker again. <laughs> I'm dying for some payback. 
Sounds good. <laughs> All right. Showtime, baby. This is an old Oscorp research lab. Shock's moving up in the world. Yeah, uh, some kind of space propulsion thing. I wasn't really paying attention. I'm gonna find another way in. I'll meet you inside. time you losers got here. I must have told every low life in New York where to find me. <laughs> <sighs> a trap? Don't take it too hard, Cat. Shocker's a crafty one. No? Wait, I'm thinking of someone else. Get ready. Here comes the pain. I hate it when he says that. <laughs> I'm gonna find some way to shut down that force field. Okay, I got it. But it looks like there's another panel we have to hit. This 
same time. Find it and instead of field it. I can't stop that field without your help. Hurry up and deactivate that console. I was right. Look at that shield go down. Let's go teach Shocker a lesson. Right, Spider? Careful, Cat. Still dangerous. This guy gave you trouble, Spider? Yeah, well, I don't know. Shocker is still a boring name. What about Jack on him? This guy gave you trouble, Spider? Yeah, well, I don't know. Hang in there, Spider. I'll try to hack the shield. You ain't taking me back in. <laughs> yeah, I did it. Just get that other paddle and the shield is down. I ain't letting you stop me. machine. It's going haywire. Was that as good for you as it was for me? I have to admit, you were right. I feel much better. You see? I told you, baby. Stick with me and you'll be fine. Come see me next time you're feeling down, all right? I'll see you around. She's pretty amazing, don't you think, Shock? <sighs> I think my career has just hit a new low. Ah, who cares what you think? If only all my problems could be settled with flashy climactic battles. Mary Jane's play. Maybe I can make it tonight.
can't believe I missed it again. Good night, guys. See y'all tomorrow. What's up, girly? Give me your money. Leave me alone. Okay. Yeah. Great timing. What are you doing here? You know me. Always hanging around. I'm getting married. I don't know if you heard. Oh, really? What's he like? He's... there. He loves me. And he's there. I see. I, uh, I, I have to get back to my patrol. See you around. Yeah. Next time a bunch of bugs try to dump me. It's a date. I just tell MJ the truth. I can't believe she's getting married and I'm just waving from the sidelines. Uh, was I supposed to meet Cat this evening? I guess I should go. Oh, I better get moving. What took you so long? Running late seems to be part of my idiom. You work too hard. And ditch some mild mannered civilian routine. This life is so much more fun. Look at me. Sure, I can play hero if I want. But if I don't feel like it, hmm? Give it a try. Take the weight of the world off your shoulders. You don't understand. You don't know why I do this. What? Parents got killed by a mugger? Abducted by aliens? Sold you to the circus? <laughs> it doesn't matter. Whatever the reasons, you can't change the past. What's done is done. You have to live for the present. Hippie. <laughs> All right, fine. Don't cheer up. All I'm saying is, you're gonna get an ulcer or something. I suppose, as usual, that you have the perfect thing to take my mind off my problems. Now that you mention it, there is a little something I know about. You know that warehouse on the west side near the convention center? Something big is going down. I'll race you there. All right, Moonbeam. You're on. Let's go. Move that cute little butt of yours. You don't want to miss this. I'm just getting warmed up. Hey, cat. You talk pretty tough when you're in the lead. How about now? Another stunning win for Black Cat. Not that you're bragging or anything, right? All right, let's get going. Supposedly, whatever they're selling is a pretty big deal. People, you all know why you're here. Let's start the bidding. I'll get a shiny nickel and a kick in the head. Where's you?
What were you doing? We had to drop on them. <laughs> it was more fun my way. That's totally irresponsible. What are you so upset about? We won! Well, excuse me for trying to get you to enjoy yourself. For once. This can't right. Am I just torturing myself? Do I really have to give up Peter Parker to be Spider-Man? What about the people in my life? It isn't like anyone ever sees me now. MJ. Harry. Aunt May. No matter how hard it is, I can't abandon my friends. What, do I quit being Spider-Man? No, I can't quit either. I help so many people. I can't give up being Peter Parker. But I can't give up being Spider-Man either. Maybe I can balance the two. I should track down Black Cat. I need to have a talk with her. <laughs> I was wondering if you were going to show up. We need to talk. Oh? <laughs> okay. Talk then. I don't think I can see you anymore. <laughs> Hysterical blindness? What? Oh, nothing like that. I just finally realized something. I'm not like you. I can't live the life that you do. My powers came with a responsibility, and I need the balance of a normal life. Being Spider-Man is who I am. But being just me, that's who I am, too. <laughs> Let's skip ahead to the part where you ask if we can still be friends. Can we still be friends? <laughs> Don't sound so dejected. Once I cross your path, I'm not so easy to get rid of. Go. Find your girl. That's what you want to do, right? You finally started listening to me. You're doing what you want. I... Thanks, Kat. See you around. I can do it. I can balance both. It isn't too late. Maybe I can be Spider-Man and still be with MJ. Peter. MJ, there's something I have to tell you. I know I haven't always been there. It feels like I've been going in two directions at once. I just figured everything out, though. I know what I want to do. I know who I want to be, and I know who I want to be with. I want to be with you. Peter, I'm getting married to John. Oh, I can't. 
I can't do this. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Peter. Good night. What was I thinking? I must have looked totally crazy. Things could never work out. What about the danger? I must have been out of my mind to ask her. I should just keep away from her. At least she still has Harry. Who's there? to see you again. Octavius! Glad to see you still remember me. Now I have a problem, and you seem to be the only one who can solve it for me. Tritium! <laughs> you need tritium! Bright boy. Very good. Make a deal. We want the same thing. Oh. And what would that be? <laughs> Spider-Man. Elucidate for me. You hate Spider-Man as much as I do. Both of us have lost someone we love because of him. If you bring him to me, alive, the tritium is yours. We have a bargain. Now, how to catch the freak. Go find Peter Parker. He takes pictures of that bug for the bugle. He'll know where to find him. Don't hurt him, though! Yeah, Harry's been a much better friend than I'll ever be. I'm no good for MJ anyway. She's better off with... what's his name? <laughs> Mary Jane was hating me, freaking out on her like I did in the night. Spider-Man, thank goodness you're here! That man needs to go to the hospital fast! Get him there right away. Help! I know swinging isn't super relaxing, but, uh, try to relax. That wasn't too rough a ride. Oh, thank you. Spidey. Hey, Spidey. Lose your keys? I think you saved when you should have saved. Spidey, don't! Spidey! 
Need a hand? Help! An armored car robbery! Crime doesn't pay. <laughs> Whatever. Don't worry, I'll stop him. That's mine! Get it back! Spider-Man! You better not get pizza delivered this way. She's still talking to me, at least. I get to apologize for being a jerk after all. You said the other night. Watch out! Ah, Margaret. Pass a message along for me. If you ever want to see this girl alive again, tell your photogenic arachnid friend that he will meet me alone at the Enric Towers, three o'clock this afternoon. Okay, Doc. I'm here. 
here. Where is she? Oh, she's safe. For now. Why don't you come and get her? No more stops between here and the end of the line. This is for Rosie. Do you see her here? No. I'm at risk one. Your suffering has only begun. Mary Jane didn't do anything. Did Rosie do anything? Did she? I hope this hurts you, freak. I didn't kill your wife. Oh, you could have wanted to just kill Rosie. You destroyed my life. Die, die, die! Stand still, you coward. Fight me! Your protestations of innocence sicken me. You're a fool, what? Live again? What an excellent idea. I'm gonna kill her, you know. Don't do it, Arcadia! Here's a small sample of what's in store for you. When I catch you, I'll tear your legs off. Insects like you must be swatted. Stand still, you coward! Pathetic. I despise you. your face. Insects like you must be swat. Do you see her here? No. I'll not risk my prize hostage so easily. Fight me! Stand and fight me! Pathetic. Mary Jane didn't do anything. Did Rosie do anything? Did she? I despise you. Didn't kill your wife. Oh, you did more than just kill Rosie. You destroyed my life. Ah. <clears throat> Stay back, insect. I demand satisfaction. Your protestations of innocence sicken me. When I catch you, I'll tear your legs off. This is for Rosie. Stand still, you coward. Ugh. 
We've got to stop this train. Everyone on board will be killed. business with you. You did it! Of course. And not to conclude our business. I have the tritium in here. A pleasure doing business with you one final time, Osborne. I leave you to your business and go to tend my home. Before I kill you, I want to see who you are. Peter? How can you be Spider-Man? Spider-Man killed my dad. My dad loved you like a son. Like a son. Harry, we don't have time for this. Octavius has MJ. You have to tell me where he is. I have to save her. Mary Jane. Octavius. He has a lab that he set up on an abandoned pier. She's probably there. We'll talk later, Harry. I promise. Theatrics today, Creighton. I see Osborne was too weak stomach to kill you. No matter, I'll take great pleasure in rending you limb from limb myself. Peter. Oh well. Parker, you've been sabotaging me all along. You killed my Rosie. I'm going to kill the woman you love, and then I'm going to kill you. No one else is going to die. This ends now. Indeed it does. Why? How many of these things does he have scattered around this place? We can't let you do this. The city will be destroyed. Only you shall be destroyed today, the first pet. Great. What would an out of control fusion reaction be without bursts of plasma? This experiment will prove my genius for all time. This is for Rosie. Oh! 
I hope this hurts you, freak! That's one. How many of these things does he have scattered around this place? Don't lose, Peter! I can't let you do this! The city will be destroyed! Only you shall be destroyed today, murderous pet. My genius for all time. I will destroy you. Here's a small sample of what's in store for you. Stay back, insect. The plasma bursts keep coming faster and faster. If I have to shut down the reactor, I'll be flash fried. Oh, you. Right. Only you shall be destroyed today, murderous pest. That's one. But how many of these things does he have scattered around? My genius for all time. My poor Rosie. Oh, no. 
Sorry with you. Pathetic. You will die. Here's a small sample of what's in store for you. Look out! This is her Rosie. The reactor doesn't seem to be responding. There must be another switch somewhere. I will destroy you. Oh no! That should do it. Wait a second. The reactor. The energy field is super concentrated. I think I'm in trouble. Why didn't that work? I switched everything off just like last time. It just isn't fair. No. My shield. No more shield, huh? That sounds like my cue. I will destroy you. Dearly, you're treachery. This is pretty treacherous, my poor Rosie. Doc, oh, you don't want to hurt anyone. Oh, you're wrong about that. should do it. Reactor before it's too late. This is bad. There's only one thing to do. Get the young lady out. I'm sorry, Peter. You weren't to blame for the accident. My hubris, my vanity cost Rosie her life. Now I must set things right.
tell you, MJ. I wanted to. I even tried a couple of times, but... I think a part of me always knew. Now you see why I can't be with you. It wouldn't be fair to you. I was selfish to ask you. You should marry John. Peter. Come on in. It's open. Expecting someone? MJ, you're supposed to be getting married. You. I made a decision. This involves both of us, Peter. And you need to trust me to make my own choice. I know who you are. I know the life I'm choosing. And I want to be with you. That's the way it is. Deal. Come Go get him, Tiger. Mary Jane, the girl next door, the girl I love, and now the girl waiting for me at the end of the day. Fate handed me amazing powers. <laughs>